you kidding me? Maybe. Not sure yet. I'm kind of winging. I guess the love between us there. Yeah, it's a comfort thing. Not for me. What do you want? For you to put the gun down. Get used to disappointment. You sound like my father. What? <laughs> He's always telling me that life is about misery, not happiness. That dreams only exist to make people forget about their own mediocrity. Man, that's depressing. Being the devil's daughter. I'm kidding you. What do you want? I want to punch my dad in the face. We're gonna get along just fine. Yeah. <laughs> of course, Jezebel was speaking metaphorically, but Johnny didn't notice. Jezebel was eager to help Johnny in any way she could, and vowed to find a way to sneak him into the palace. Johnny frowned at the seemingly arbitrary amount of time required for Jezebel to find a way to sneak him in. But he accepted the fact that without traditional missions, this was the best way to further the story. Yeah. <laughs> Jezebel went back home. She's gonna let us know when she can sneak you in. In the meantime, let's wait. Someone's in your... Hey! Get your hands off me, you fucking troglodyte! We have your friends, mortal. And they will writhe until their screams no longer please. Dane, remember your corporate abduction training. Yeah, boy. That's right, man. Never mess with me. I owe you there a thing. You don't pay me. Even better. Yeah. Thank you. 
Blackbeard. these things can do. You imperialist dogs will never break me. That's probably because they have no experience in advanced interrogation. Now if I were doing it... Fucking king me. I'm getting the hang of this murder thing. Oh, our demon air. Dreams. Then this. Oh, it's been a fortnight of indignity. I know how you feel. I had to wear a poodle skirt once. Be alone. Bear. A young maiden, loyal and true, eager to save the bard. Is she motivated by friendship, by pragmatism? Who is to say what our heroine is thinking? Wow. What the fuck is going on here? Bullshit. 
acabando. Oh, fuck you. Ok, um tap drink. to be down. Stop the teening. My sister wants this. No. No. His power returning to his cheeks. The bard inquires how he can show his thanks to Kinsey Kensington. I want in your spy ring. The bard looks at his new protege. <laughs> the wicked smile stretching across his lips as he thinks of the possibilities. A new trap. Good moving, Shakespeare, please. And scene. <laughs> Thank you. For that, I am all. A damned soul's orientation guide, chapter thirty three The Deadly Sin. No longer just delightful pastimes, pride, wrath. Envy, lust, gluttony, greed, and sloth have become personified in the form of weapons. Only the most deserving, wretched soul will be blessed with one of these treasured artifacts. Yeah. 